Uh, thank you, uh, Mr. Speaker. And like many members, I've had emails from Afghan in this country worried about their people back in Afghanistan. And the Home Office and the Foreign Office have managed to get some of those people relocated. But I had the extraordinary situation, sir, where I had an email, a very detailed email, about these Afghans who had been persecuted, who had worked for the British, and it was very detailed and they produced all the documentation. And the following day, my constituent wrote to me and said, I'm really sorry, it's a complete lie. These people are Taliban and I can't go through with this masquerade. I just wonder, sir, whether well, we should be on a guard against getting such people into this country. Uh, my, my honourable friend will be relieved, I'm sure, like many people in this House, to, to know that from the very beginning of, of pitting and uh, the Arab scheme and all the subsequent schemes that we've put in place, the very highest possible security checks have been instituted to make sure that people are who they say they are and that we receive to this country uh, the people who genuinely uh, deserve to come here.